Despite the historic usage of wind power to drain water and grind grain, the Netherlands today lags behind most EU countries in the production of energy from renewable sources. The leading renewable sources in the country are biomass, wind, solar and both geothermal and aerothermal power mostly from ground source and air source heat pumps. In 2014, the Netherlands produced only 5.5% of its total energy from renewables, a small rise from 3.7% in 2010 and just 1% in 1990. Among the EU countries, only Malta and Luxembourg had lower percentages. The low take up of renewable energy may be partially explained by the flat and often sub sea level landscape and subsequent limits to hydropower resources, although hydro poor resource countries such as Denmark have still managed to make renewables the focus of their energy needs. In 2015, Dutch wind turbines had a total nameplate capacity of 3,431 megawatts. Wind and solar power installations had a record-breaking year during 2015 and this may move the Netherlands closer to its target of 37% of electricity production coming from renewables by 2020. A number of large offshore wind farms have either come online recently, Gemini Wind Farm, or have been granted authorization, Borzel 1 and 2 and Borzel 3 and 4 wind farms. Most of the tiny contribution made to electricity generation by hydroelectricity came from three power plants. A large part of the renewable electricity sold in the Netherlands comes from Norway, a country which generates almost all its electricity from hydropower plants. In the Netherlands, household consumers can choose to buy renewable electricity. Since 2008, the amount of renewable energy used by household users has been increasing, rising from 38% in 2008 to 41% by 2009, and up to 44% by mid-2010, one area in which the Netherlands is a relative leader is in the adoption of electric plug-in vehicles. In 2015 PEV vehicles in the Netherlands represented 9.74% of car sales, making it the world's second highest share after Norway. Electric vehicles are able to run on renewable electricity with zero emissions and have the potential to provide grid power storage facilities. <laughs> Energy consumption by sector All EU countries as well as Iceland and Norway submitted National Renewable Energy Action Plans to outline the steps taken, and projected progress by each country between 2010 and 2020 to meet the Renewable Energy Directive targets for each country. Each plan contains a detailed breakdown of each country's current renewable energy usage and plans for future developments. According to projections by the Dutch submission in 2020 the gross final energy consumption in the Netherlands by sector breaks down as follows Asterisk after adjustments Using the unadjusted NREAP data approximately half of energy consumption is used in the heating and cooling sector the heating and cooling sector, also known as the thermal sector, includes domestic heating and air conditioning, industrial processes such as furnaces and any use of heat generally. The next largest share is the electricity sector at 24.7%, followed by the transport sector at 22.5%. Total annual energy consumption before adjustments for aviation is projected to be 52,000 KTOE 52 million tons of oil equivalent by 2020 in order to meet the Netherlands overall target for 14.5% or 14% using the slightly different renewable energy directive calculation methodology use of renewable energy in gross final energy consumption by 2020 it was just 2.5% in 2005 targets have been set for each sector Renewable energy targets for the year 2020 by sector are, 8.7% in the heating and cooling sector, 37% in the electricity sector and 10.3% in the transport sector. <laughs> Recent trends in renewable energy 
The Netherlands has a minimum target of 14% of renewable energy use by 2020. The sectoral targets for 2020 break down into national targets of 8.7% in the heating and cooling sector, 37% in the electricity sector and 10.3% in the transport sector although these figures may be slightly different from those implied by the minimum trajectory path. The following table shows the actual results recorded of renewable energy use by sector. Actual overall renewable energy use grew from 4.3% in 2009 to 5.5% 5 .5 by 2014. The minimum trajectory plan for 2013-2014 was 5.9% and for 2015-2016 7.6% of total energy use. The Netherlands is regarded as amongst the most likely countries to miss 2020 national renewable energy targets as outlined by the Renewable Energy Directive. Sources Wind power 2016 was a record year for new wind turbine installations totaling 887 MW bringing the totaled installed capacity to 4,328 MW by year end. 691 MW of the new installations were offshore. The Dutch government has a target of 6,000 MW of onshore wind power by 2020 and 4,450 MW of offshore wind power by 2023. In 2017, the Netherlands had 2,294 wind turbines. The wind capacity installed at end 2017 will, in a normal wind year, produce 9% of electricity, when the equivalent value for Germany was 16.1% and Portugal 14%. topic solar power by 2017 year end cumulative installed capacity of solar pv power reached a preliminary estimate of 2749 megawatts with 700 megawatts added in that year alone whilst the netherlands saw its capacity grow by the fourth highest in europe during 2017 its installed capacity per inhabitant remained relatively low at 160.9 watts per inhabitant compared to the european average of 208.3 watts per inhabitant topic <inaudible> biomass <inaudible> 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 Sources of biomass in the Netherlands include the biogenic fraction of waste that is burned in waste incineration plants. Waste wood is also collected for use in the Netherlands and other EU countries. Manure is used to produce biogas and wood pellets are co-fired in electricity plants. 590 kton of pellets were imported, mostly from the United States of America and around 140 kton from Dutch sources contributing 12 to 13 petajoules of primary energy to co-firing in energy plants in 2013-2014. Biofuels are produced in the Netherlands for both domestic and export markets. Rapeseed and corn crops were hardly used in 2014 to produce biofuels in Holland with reasons cited being the high price of corn and resistance to using food crops for fuel production. Rapeseed is used for well over 1% of the imported biofuels biodiesel while corn is used for 11% bioethanol. Germany was the largest supplier of rape seed in 2014 53%, followed by Romania 13%. For corn the largest supplier in 2014 was Ukraine 39%, followed by France 24%. Some maize fodder is fermented for biofuel production in Holland. Biomass produced 76,657 terajoules of energy for final consumption in 2013. The largest share was destined for the heat sector at 42,886 terajoules followed by the electricity sector at 21,649 TJ and then the transport sector with 12,123 terajoules. Hydroelectricity <inaudible> 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 
Due to its flat landscape the Netherlands has only very limited hydroelectric resources. In 2014 hydroelectricity produced just 112 GWh of power out of a total electricity production from all sources of 103,418 Topic: <laughs> Warm milk An interesting source of heat recovery used in the Netherlands is sourced from freshly milked milk, or warm milk. However at 0.3% of total renewable energy production 2010 figures, this source is not likely to accelerate energy transition in the country. Warm milk is still not mentioned in the EU Renewable Energy Directive, nor in international energy statistics and so is not included as gross final consumption figures. It does however provide Dutch farmers with plenty of hot water. In 2010, 740,000 dairy cows about half of the country's total provided 277 terajoules of heat energy avoiding 18,000 tonnes of CO2 emissions. According to industry sources for every litre of milk cooled, 0.7 litres of warm water is produced. Water pumped through the plate heat exchanger reaches 50 degrees Celsius to 55 degrees Celsius. The energy recovered from 1,000 liters of milk per day over a year generates heat equal to 13,100 kilowatt hours of electrical energy, 1,900 liters of oil, 1,650 cubic meters of natural gas, or 950 kilograms of propane gas. Topic: Climate change. According to the ex Prime Minister Jan Peter Balkenende, the Netherlands use annually 1 minus 1.5 billion euros, 0.3% of national income, to protect against the risks of the sea level rise. Many areas are under sea level in the Netherlands and are protected by dam and dikes. The Netherlands supported in 2010 raising the European Union emission restrictions from 20% to 30%. However, the Netherlands has only committed to reaching the minimum 14% goal for itself. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Historical trends 1990 to 2011. The main sources of renewable energy up to 2011 were from biomass and wind power. Solar power was marginal with only 143 megawatts installed capacity by 2011. Energy from hydroelectric sources in 2011 was only marginally greater than that provided from heat extracted from warm milk. Total renewable energy use was just 1.1% of overall energy use in 1990. The electricity sector first overtook the heating and cooling sector in 2005 in terms of total renewable energy use. See also Wind power in the Netherlands Solar power in the Netherlands Hydroelectric power in the Netherlands Electricity sector in the Netherlands Energy in the Netherlands External links European Commission National Renewable Energy Action Plans European Commission Renewable Energy Progress Reports European Commission National Energy Efficiency Action Plans <laughs>